Hey guys, how's it going? Sean the Magic the Gathering Guy here to tell you the exciting things about nothing. Um, nothing at all. I'm on vacation. I'm loving it. I, I'm trying to make sure this is in the right uh, position. So what I have here is another pack from uh, the Walmart. I figured, you know, it has Sarah on the front. That's a good sign. Um, I just felt like opening something. So I haven't gotten to get to my box yet because there's no parking at the store I go to. So uh, that's kind of sad, but you know how it goes, right? Um, you know, these are these are cool pieces of cardboard. We gotta take care of them, make sure they're uh, they're pretty awesome. I mean you can probably see my face if you look in the reflection there a little bit, but I don't realize that's kinda hard. So without further ado, we're gonna crack these bad boys open. I don't know what it is about this packaging. This packaging. Uh oh, oh, I got it this time. I got it this time. Last time this thing was like impossible to open. Oh no, careful Sarah. So we have an Urza, a Sarah, and a bear. That is what we have brought ourselves to. So I'm looking at it in the sense of, uh, I don't know. We're going to find out what happens. I'm going to get some good cards, I think. I'm going to be really happy and be excited. And, and I'm going to be, like, thrilled. That's what I like to see. We're going to start with, uh, let's see, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. You know how that whole rhythm goes. But it's going to be the bear. We know it's going to be the bear. So I figured, I, I was of the mind when I was buying these. If I buy them out of my local LGS, which I do support and I love, there's always a chance that the good cards are already gone. Somebody's already picked them out of the packages, right? Out of the box they have sitting on the shelf. Unless I see that box being open and then I grab them. But in this case, said the, the ones at the store will always be pre-packaged, pre-sealed, and they're always going to be randomized, so I have no clue. So I figured, you know what? I'm going to go for it. So we have a soldier token. We have a whole uh, whole bunch of flying swords. There's our little art card. Uh, snow snow covered swamp. You ready? And an endling. Is that endling worth anything? Endling gains mass until a turn. Endling gains death touch in a turn. Endling gains undying until a turn. Endling gets plus one minus okay or either or. You know what? That is okay. That is not that bad for four for a three three. I am, I am going to take that one and say that is not a bad card. I'm not sure if it's worth anything. That's a cool looking golem. Look at that. Come on, one for a two, two. That's cool. All right, those go to my uncommon pile down here. And of course, the other ones are just all the cool commons. We'll take those bad boys off the screen from all you guys. We're going to go to our next pack, which will be Urza, which I have not gotten one yet. I mean, it'd be cool if I got some like Ren of Six. I, I don't have one of those either. I'm just saying, you know, before I open these packs, if they want to be nice to me, they can be some of them. So I think, uh, let's see, let's see. We have the zombie token. The Morphian. That's a cool looking card. Oh, snow covered plains. Very awesome. And oh my god, the fallen shinobi. How disappointing. He's a 5 forward ninjutsu, but I just don't. He's not my type of card. So he'll sit there below the endling. Take my own commons, put them in my pile. And the air ones go over here. All right, this is it, guys. The moment of truth. This is the one. I don't know what it's the one of, but, but I mean, it's, it's the one. So we're going to. All right, this is it. This is the golden ticket. This is Willy Wonka standing in the chocolate factory with a flying illusion. And oh, that's kind of, I don't remember this card. That's kind of creepy, isn't it? Looks like a, like a mannequin or something. This thing, take, oh, that's kind of creepy. Snow covered island. Very cool. Are you ready? Are you ready? Here we go. Hey, I will take it. That is a silent clearing. That is a very good rare. I will I will take that because that is a cool land. I will take these and take them off screen onto my pile. I don't care about prohibit and all these other ones. They're just comments. But I look at this and say, okay, I think the endlings were something. I don't care about the fallen shinobi. Oh, I think I can go over here. Um, but that silent clearing does have value. So I'd say... All in all, not a bad looking pack for me, guys. 
Um, very cool. So that's why I managed to gather us three packs today. I opened on my vacation because I haven't been able to get to the card shop there because there's no parking. That's right. You heard me. No parking. Up North Games, there's no parking, buddy. Come on, guys. All right, shout out to all my regular guys. We got Pause, we got Vasily, we got MTG Revealed, we got Andrew, we got Braun. You guys are awesome, man. Thanks a lot. I really appreciate it, guys. I will do some more videos later in the week and uh, keep this ball rolling. Please make sure you watch videos as, as, as much as you can because it's awesome to shout each other out and help each other. And, you know, cool. And if you're new to my channel and you're just like, wow, that was short sweet and not too painful then go ahead hit the subscribe button we'd love to have you join in the party uh, you can put comments down in the comment section about how awesome or not awesome that pack opening was and that'll be cool to know all right guys i only got like about 12 seconds left because i'm gonna try to keep this one at the six minute mark i just want to mention mox amber in a free fall Ooh, i like it it's looking good for me all right cheers guys bye